Have you mixed the cards? Yes, Father. Then make the spread. Now, turn the first card. What is it? It is death, Father. Oh, don't be afraid, child. It's my death. I expect it. Turn the next. Lamed, the hanged man. Mm. It's the card of Judas, the betrayer. Judas? Mortimer, my former steward. He's an old man and a girl, alone in a run-down castle. A treasure just waiting to be taken. What is the third card? I am the tower. I am. It is the card of sudden change, of violence and destruction. Now the fourth. I don't understand. What is it, child? It is the fool, father. And the fool can mean many things. Youth, strength of will, independence, adventure. Wait! But it has darker meanings, too. What day it is? Thursday. It's the summer solstice. We got three days till Midsummer's Eve. How do you know that? Because it meant something in Hadesage. We had banquets and games. There was a maypole. Girls. Girls? Where? In Hadesage. <laughs> well, come on, man. Oh, John. It's the summer solstice. We must do something. When Robin gets back. No. No, not when Robin comes back. No. Do you just want to sit in the sun and do nothing? Yes. Yes. Me too. We could have something to eat. Oh, tuck, that's all you ever think about. Right. Oh. Fetch us something. What? One of the king's deer. Roast duck. A girl. Mm. <laughs> Why me? Because it was your idea. That's right. One of the king's deer. Right. <laughs> right. Well, come on, then, the rest of you. Get up. What is it now? We are going to have a tug of war like we used to have in Addison. Oh, what? 
A tug of war. Wake up, Scarlet. I am awake. No, you're not. I am. You are now. Sorry, lad. <laughs> Thanks, John. Why have you called me? To warn you. It is a time of trials. A power is drawing near. The king that was and the king that is to be. What king is this? I cannot tell you. I cannot help you. His power is greater than mine and I am bound by it. But I serve you. For the present. Soon you will be asked to choose, and you must make that choice alone. Unusual sight, that is. A girl in man's clothes, alone in the forest. I've been traveling, looking for someone. Maybe you can help me for Robin Hood. Robin Hood, is it? Well, let me see now. Maybe I can and maybe I can't. But it'll uh, cost you. I mean, you know, Robin Hood, he's not cheap. I have no money. Oh, no money. Well, you dress like a peasant. And you talk like a lady. I haven't yet seen a lady without money. Get out of my way. Liam. Summer game. Winter versus summer. Good against evil. Which is which? That one's definitely evil. Well, well. Brother Tuck, with company. We send you out to bag us some lunch, and this is what you bring back. 
I must say, your aim's improving. This is Isadora. I found her. Lady, I'm John Little. At your service. I'm William Skeflock. Um, that's Nazir, Much, Marion, and he's Robin Hood. It's you I've come to see. If there's anything we can do. Anything at all. There's an old man and a girl alone in a rundown castle and a treasure just waiting to be taken. I don't know. Two years I served him, and I never saw it. But he often spoke of it. He said there was nothing more precious in England. Nothing more precious in England. Half for you, half for me. Oh, yes! <laughs> Split you right down the middle. <laughs> so, you say the castle's empty, and yet your father refuses to leave. You tell us there's bandits on the way to steal something that isn't there, and you don't even know who these bandits are. Why can't you tell us any more? I can't. Look, it doesn't matter what the, tr the trouble is. What matters is she needs help. He's right. We can't cross England on those terms. Why not? We don't know anything about it. Why can't you and your father leave the castle? We can't leave Curly on. But if there's nothing there, I've then... I've told you everything I can. And I'm sorry. The answer's no. A long way to go. We must leave now. I said. No. I said now. Your father, Agravain. He sent for you. We must go to him. I'll wake the others. No, Robin. He sent for you alone. What he wishes. Then we'll go. We don't know that it isn't. We've been gone after night. We don't know where, and you say nothing's happened. We don't know. That's right, Tuck. We don't know. We don't know nothing about her, who she is, or where she comes from. Kaleon. Wherever that is. Stop it! That's enough. Tuck's right. We'll find them. They can't have gone far, so we'll find them. Did you know the ring belonged to my father? No, but my father said you'd recognize it. And how is Lord Agravain? Well, he hasn't been... Shh. What is it? Someone following us. Take these. Keep 
walking. Go. Match. Saw you last night. I was worried. Where are you going? Kerlian. Where's that? You could have been quieter. You're like a stampeding horse. Kerlian. Where is it? We've got company. So I see. Well, I didn't ask him to come. Well, don't try and send me back. Because I won't. Come on, we'll go together. Good. That's all right then. The Curlian. No, Curlian. Well, you haven't found them. Nothing. Nazia. Well, first Robin and the girl, then all three. Much. What's going on? Oh, this. Oh, well, that's wonderful, that is, an error. I've got enough errors on my own. It's a sign. A sign for what? To follow him. Well, why didn't he ask us in the first place? I'll follow him. Where to? The castle, Kalir. It doesn't make sense. I know it doesn't make sense, but we're not going to find out anything by sitting around here and talking about it, are we? You're right, Les. It's a fair walk to Kalian. Then we'd better get started. Are you coming? Of course we are. Nas. Top. All right, then. To Kalian. of Kerlian. They're preparing the midsummer feast. A feast? They didn't ask us. <laughs> Scully? My lord. Two lines. My lord. What are you doing? What does it look like? But why? I'm a soldier, Mortimer. So are all of us. You take that Scully then. He used to be a page to a knight chevalier before he cut the man's throat to follow me. We fought three years for God in the Crusades. The holy war. <laughs> three stinking, lousy years in the heat and the dust and the filth, dying of thirst, starvation and disease before we even set eyes on a Saracen. They promised us a seat in heaven and they sent us to hell. So now we work for ourselves, soldiers of fortune. And this village has just had the misfortune to get in our way.
Father. Robin Hood. Lord Agravain. The last time I saw you, you were still being wet nursed. Now look at you, Robin in the Hood. Wolf's head, an outlaw. The Earl of Huntington's son. My godson. There's little time left to us, Robin. In this castle, there is a great treasure, more priceless than anything in England, and it's yours. Yours to inherit. There's been an Agravain in Caerleon for 700 years. The inheritance has passed down the line from generation to generation, but uh, we've reached the end of that line. My wife, God rest her soul, died in childbirth. And that child was a girl. Isadora's been a dutiful child. But a girl. That's why I've sent for you. What is this treasure, my lord? You'll find out in good time. But only if you succeed in defending the castle. The time of trials is upon us. Our enemies. I don't see anyone. They'll come. Later today. We could close the main gate. No. But they'll tell them they're expected. Let them ride in. We'll take them here, in between the two gates. That gate won't close. The wood's rotten. Then we'll block it. It's going to be difficult. Just the two of us. Three? You've got me. You? You stay with your father. No! I'll fight with you. This is my home. I've lived here all my life. It should be my inheritance, but I'm to lose it. Why? Because I'm a woman. You treat me like a fool, but you don't even know what's here. Well, what is here? It's been in front of your eyes and you haven't seen it. And that's how you'll fight, blindly. But I'll fight because it's rightfully mine and I know it's worth fighting for. So tell me, Robin, which of the two of us does that make the fool? What's happened? It's like a battlefield. What do you think, soldiers? Worse. What happened here, friend? Look, we're just trying to help. Where are we? Kalean. Kalean upon us. We're looking for the castle. On the other side of the hill. We've got to go there, but I promise we'll be back. They've gone there, but they won't come back. He'll see to that. Who? The king that was. The king that is to be. Come. I don't know. I don't know. What do they want here? We'll find out. Robin! Go.
Now tell me about this girl then. She pretty? Yes. Too good for you though, eh? My idea's above your station. That's what she said. <laughs> No business here. Go back. Do you know him? No. And you never will. Jack. Men killed, three men wounded, and you told me the castle was undefended. It was. I don't understand. I ought to kill her. Die! Okay. Take four men. Go back into the village. Pick up a woman, any woman you like, or a child, and bring her back here. Understood? A woman. Right. Move. We're wasting a lot of time. We're lost. How can you lose a castle? A castle? <laughs> Nazir will find a trail. Marion? Marion? Where are you going? I'm thirsty, Will. Do you hear something? Don't hear nothing. Woo! Look, don't keep on. I 
I'm sorry, I was wrong, all right? There is something. That's all we need. Come on. Come on. Where's the others? My lord. My lord, my lord, it's all you ever say, isn't it? Never mind. Bring her with us. Whatever's in that castle better be worth it for your sake. They're coming back. to see an innocent girl killed. Now open the gate. Well, come on. Open the gate or the girl dies. If you go down there, they will kill you. If I don't, they'll kill her. You can't. I have to. Come on, Chuck, we can't wait till one. I'll catch you up. Treasure. Oh, come on, you must tell me. You've got to tell me. If you don't tell me, I'm going to have to kill you. You understand? You know him. You speak to him. You make him talk. How could 
you do it? How could you do it to him? No, Marion! Marion, he's not dead. He came here to help you. He came here because you made him! He's not dead, Marion! He's not dead. Tell her much. It's true. We planned it to gain time. He's out there now. Robin Hood. Back from the dead, are we? A miracle? Someone lend me a sword. Tuck. How will they get in? I hung a rope over the battlements. It was my idea. That's good. Very good. They will find it, won't they? Oh, yes, they'll find it. Now all we have to do is wait. Talk, you've half killed him. He won't talk because you've got nothing to say. He won't talk because there's nothing here. Nothing. It's just an old, mouldy, drafty castle. Even a goblet's a man. I tell you, you're sitting on a fortune. There is no fortune. It's here, in the castle. There is. Shelly! <laughs> Hello. Check the guards. You two go down and bring a girl up here. No, bring them all up here. Nothing more precious in England. Did much do this? He's learning. Oh. I can't climb it. Not with that arm. He's right. I'll go. I'll go. Will. Go on, then. What do you mean, Will? There's nothing to him. Go on, then. All right, I'm going. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Now listen, old man, this is your last chance. Either you tell me, or I kill them all one at a time. The king. Uta son. In Avalon. What do you say? Will? Most. Yeah! Oh, 
Yes. So. So. They will come. Who will come? Kill the boy. No. Well, tell me then! My lord, my lord, I... You! You're dead! Am I? Well, you are now. It's on, didn't you? The table. King Arthur and the Round Table. The king that was, and the king that is to be. It's been here all the time. This castle. Caerleon upon Usk. I had another name once, Camelot. Look. I'm here, my lord king. There has been an Agravain at Camelot since the first Agravain, brother of Gawain, the knight of the round table. For it is the table that unites us, 
a symbol of our power now past, the emblem of our power to come. The table must be protected. Should it ever be destroyed, the power that binds our knights together in the Vale of Avalon will perish with it. You have served us well, Agrave, but now your hour has come. Whom do you name as your successor? My liege, I have no son, but a godson. I name Robin of Sherwood, only son of the Earl of Huntington. Robin of Sherwood. Will you kneel and swear fealty to us? No, great king. I cannot. Cannot or will not? I cannot. I serve another. You must. Why? You have no son, but you have a daughter worth any son. Isadora has lived her whole life in your service. How can you deny her her rightful inheritance? He has spoken well, Agrave. Isadora, will you take the oath of fealty? My liege, I will. Approach. The inheritance stays in the family of Agrave and always will. Don't weep, Isadora. Your father died knowing the table had found its rightful guardian. Another three days' walk. Can't do you good sleep. Not in this heat. Get out. Midsummer's Day, lad. Could you have stayed there in Kerlian? Would you have stayed with me? Tonight. Look. Hearn's waiting. 